commercial break, you know. Sure head on. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a summer clothing haul. This is both male and female and you're so far away because I wanted enough room that I could stand and show you guys these pieces. But I wanted to show you, I have all of these clothing items to go through plus a bunch of swimsuits for me. I'm going to get started with Jonathan's first. So the first thing I got him was this black champion t-shirt and also it has been worn. Before I go into any further detail, I did want to tell you guys, I got all of this either at TJ Maxx, Dirt Cheap, or Shein. So it was from TJ Maxx. I want to say I paid maybe $9.99 for it. I can't remember. And again, like some of the price tags aren't on these, so I cannot remember. The second shirt that I got him also from TJ Maxx was just this Tommy Hilfiger and it's in this really pretty sand color and that is the little sign right there. But yeah, just got him this little tan Tommy Hilfiger t-shirt. And then the third shirt also from TJ Maxx, it was just this, I don't know what color you would actually call this. I'm, I'm unsure, but it's like green with like blue hems on the side. So I actually got these today and it's just like these, um, they, I mean, technically they're cargo shorts, but they're really thin material. So I don't know if that'll help kind of tell you what type of material it is, but it's good for summer. I do not like this little maneuver. I don't like that, but you can easily take that off and he may like that. So if he likes it, he can have that on there, but got these from dirt cheap today for six bucks. Then a bunch, well, the rest of his stuff is from dirt cheap. Cause I went to dirt cheap on Tuesday. Today is actually April 15th. And on the 13th, I got my second COVID vaccine in my arm. And, um, I had went to dirt cheap afterwards just to browse. Honestly, didn't really know what I was going in there to look for just browse and I left with 15 items. So one of the items from Dirt Cheap were these swimming trunks and they're just the trunks um, Surf and Swim Co. He got these, whoops, and these were $5. Another thing were these shorts. So another just good staple for like summery shorts and they're just in this navy color. They are golf shorts and no, he does not golf, neither do I but they're really breathable and you know when it's super hot outside and if we were to go to like dinner or something they would look nice enough for that and i want to say i paid i'm trying to remember what o was i think o was five dollars and these were originally 30 bucks one of these other shirts also from dirt cheap was this hawaiian shirt and now that i think about it i did go into the intentions of going to dirt cheap to get hawaiian styled button up shirts and you can only see that there's only one button on it but it's just really stinking cute i think this one was four dollars i can't really remember for sure but it was either it was four dollars for sure but just really cute it is a target brand as well there is no other tag to say like what the original price was and i i'm sorry i'm talking and my head's cut off but four dollars and then this may be his last piece of clothing. This is a Banana Republic button up shirt. It's just stripes all the way down. Paid $3 for this and it's so cute and it feels so nice. And it was such a deal considering it was three bucks. So he got this. Hi, this is just um, Kayla interrupting her own haul. I forgot to add these in there, but I also had gotten Jonathan these shorts at TJ Maxx for like $9.99, I believe, but they're just this cute little gray, light blue color. And so I did get this for Valentine's Day, but I did ask for it for the intentions of wearing it for the summer because it's also super popular. It was on Amazon. I think it was like $12.99, but it just has a J on it. And then I got three new pairs of earrings and they're all <clears throat> huggers. And so I'm going to show you guys, I have them linked together, but that first one looks like this. And then we just have some gold huggers right here. That looks like that. And then we have these 
right here, which I don't know if those are going to want to focus. But you can kind of see they're just huggers, have diamonds around them. First, just jumping off into it, I got these shorts and they look white, but they're really like a light gray. And they're like in the athletic, they're, they're made out of cotton. Let's just say that. They're made out of cotton. They're really stinking cute. They have pockets on the side, pockets here, and they're so comfortable. But I also got them in this blue color. And they're just so cute. I love them. 10 out of 10 for me, because I've worn this pair, so I know that these pair will be great. But I've worn these pair, fantastic. I got this two-piece set, which is kind of hard to see. But this is a tank top. And then we have the matching shorts. This, this is actually like a pajama set. But for this right here, you can actually like wear this with like, I'm thinking maybe some baggy jeans and it would still look really cute. So, got this. And I have been wanting to try out a pair of overalls. And you know, it's very hit or miss when it comes to overalls. So, I bought a pair from Walmart to see if I'd even like them. I love them, just to be completely honest with you. I think I needed, I wanted more of the oversized look and I think I should have sized up one more. And so I think I bought a large, yeah. And I think I should have gotten an extra large just for that super oversized. Look, these are oversized on me a little bit. It's more of the, the length of it, I guess you could say, was a little weird. But all around, I really liked them. Got these little overalls. And this is what the back looks like. Then from TJ Maxx, I got this cute dress. And so I got quite a few dresses because I don't own a lot of dresses. I think I own two dresses. So picked up this one from TJ Maxx and it just looks like this. I'll get close so you can see like the pattern. And it's just a spaghetti strap. It's super cute on. And I like how the top of it is that cinching material. So it really cinches you here, but then it's not super tight all the way down. So even though it's spaghetti strap, I feel like it really covered up and like the girls were fine is what I'm basically trying to say and yeah this one was from TJ Maxx next we have this little dress and it's also looks like it's getting like whitened out from my view but this one was from Walmart and I got this one in the large as well and this one fits like a glove it's so sinking cute on it's so soft and it actually came with a matching mask which is hanging on my door over there it's very cute, it's a good length, it's not too short, not too long, and I really like it. My only thing I don't like about it is it has sewn in pads, like around the breast. The next dress I have is actually, again, from Walmart, and it's kind of similar to the color-wise. It's just a little bit darker blue, and I actually have this dress in a navy blue that I bought two years ago, and I saw that they had these dresses back at Walmart, and so I was like, I love those dresses. Like they're so comfy to wear because they are a little bit longer. So like I could wear this out somewhere and then not have to worry about, you know, the, the wind blowing in my dress coming all the way up. Cause it is a little heavier and thicker. It also has pockets, which I know some people hate having pockets and dresses. I absolutely love it. I think two things from Sheen and I'm going to show them at the same time. Uh, they're both bodysuits and I know that they're long sleeve and I have another one somewhere cannot find it but it's like this first one that you're looking at but it's in a brown it's like in a, a deep chocolate color because that color is really really in and so I got this blue one and uh, the brown one and then I also got this one and this one was just more of like a cuter one it's got the ruffles around the neck and there's also ruffles around the wrist and it has like that ribbed material which I really like and so this one you could also wear it under like a baggy t-shirt not necessarily like this one but like a baggy band tee especially the next dress I have to show you is a little not my style at all but I thought it was so stinking cute and it was out during Easter dresses but it is just this long probably it's probably a midi dress you could say it's a mini dress. It has a little slip under it because you can obviously see that it's like transparent. But it's actually Lucky Brand and this dress was originally $109 and I paid $24 a steal. But just getting up closer so that you can see 
kind of what it looks like. And then lastly from Shein, I got this. This is such a fun shirt. I actually wore this with the overalls that I showed you guys earlier. And it's just this cropped long sleeve shirt. And then I do not own animal print. I don't wear animal print. If you are, just as a warning, and if you like the shirt and you go and find it, if you are heavier chested and you don't wear a bra with this, if you raise your hands above your head, they're going to come out. So, just as a warning... But I feel like if, and also if you do wear a bra and you like, you stick your hands up like this, you're going to be able to see the bra under. I have two more pieces of clothing to show you guys from Dirt Cheap. And so I got this romper. It's just in this maroon color. There's like the little key cutout or keyhole cutout right there. And it has that cute little tie in the front. It's so cute. It is Target brand Wild Fable. And I got this at Dirt Cheap for $4.00. Does not have pockets, which is fine, but it is a romper. Another good staple for, like, going to the beach. And then the last piece of clothing-wise that I got was this shirt from Dirt Cheap. And it's also Wild Fable. And it's just, like, this gold mustardy color. And I just have an envision of wearing these with my baggy jeans and either a white tennis shoe or my Doc Martens. Or you could even, like, dress this up even more and wear, like, a tight skirt with it. It also has that ribbed material that I really like. And this was originally 12 bucks, but I paid 6 So not as great of a deal, but I didn't buy it at full price. So there's that. But if you ever just need like a good sandal but don't want to pay a lot of money, go to freaking Walmart. I got these sandals right here, I think for $9.99. They're so comfortable and they're so freaking cute. They have that wavy that braided material that's what i was looking for that word they have the braided material i've worn them already a couple of times especially like to work and stuff such a good piece and then these were more of an impulse buy at tj maxx but just a pair of flip-flops they were 12.99 they're pink but they would also just be cute if i need to slip them on to like run downstairs or at the beach like they would be cute for anything and i don't actually have a pair of flip-flops so I picked these up. Hello. It's just me interrupting the haul video again. I found this piece and it was one of my favorite pieces and I don't know why it was in the dirty clothes because I have not worn it. But I did get this for like as a summer haul. So I wanted to show you guys. This is just like a cropped, very, very cropped. It might as well just be a bra type of shirt. And as you can see, there's like the little circle hole in the middle and it's that ribbed material again. I don't know why, but I'm really in, if it'll focus, I'm really into that ribbed material and it looks really cute on, like you don't have to wear a bra unless you just prefer to wear a bra to cover up, you know, your nipples getting hard or whatever. But I just wanted to show you guys that real quick. And yeah, let's just keep on rolling with the the rest of the haul because I obviously have not been on YouTube in a while and if you have any questions about that put them down below I'll be glad to answer these swimsuits that I got from Dirt Cheap and Shein so I think I only got two from Shein this year and I first picked up this one piece which is honestly going to be so hard to show you guys so I'll show you the top of it first because it's connected like this but it's just this one shoulder piece like this and then the bottoms are like, they just look like this. The second swimsuit I got is a two piece and it's just a bikini and it looks like this. And it just came with these green bottoms to match that darker green pieces. So again, it just would look something like that. And then from Walmart, I actually picked up this one piece. This one piece is so freaking cute. The only thing I don't like about it is it's a little bit too much coverage back here and kind of gives me the I'm wearing granny panties look in my opinion but there is nothing you can't just pull that thing up you know what I mean so here's this also Jonathan just came in so I'll be back in one moment to show you guys the rest of the bikinis okay I'm back sorry about that Jonathan had just came home he's actually in the shower so if you hear the water running 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 don't worry about that I just have a couple more pieces to show you guys and then I'll actually be done so the second swimsuit 
Well, actually, no. I think we're getting into, I have just shown you guys this one piece that I had gotten from Walmart. I love it. Just in case I didn't show you guys, it's got this really, it's a ribbed material as well. Has a V or I guess you could say this is a V back. I would call that more of a U, but it's got that V back. Kind of gives me the granny panty look on the butt, but it's nothing you can't just pull up and fix. So really stinking cute. Then the rest is going to be dirt cheap swimsuits. And they're also all Target brand except for one piece, I believe. But I just picked up these yellow bottoms like this. And then as a top, I picked up this top. So it's just a bandeau top. And it also can be worn with straps if you prefer straps as well. This so. swimsuit was actually like, I'm not going to say it was an impulse buy, but I had found these bottoms and I was like, oh my goodness, these bottoms are so stinking cute. They also have that cheekiness to it. So it cinches back here. And I was like, okay, these bottoms are so cute. But I had grabbed, I think, a extra large in the bottoms because I never know what size I am in bottoms. I know I'm not a medium or a small. Let's just say that. I don't know if I'm either like a large or an extra large. So I picked up, I think, one or the other and then I needed to go get either a size smaller or bigger. I can't remember. But I saw these and I was like, okay, let me go search for a smaller size. Found them. But in the meantime, found the matching top to it. So it just looks like this. And then in the back, it's gotta be kind of hard to show. Here, I'll just flip it over. I know that probably does not work for you guys, but just ties in the back like this. This was my all time favorite find or my favorite swimsuit that I got. And it's just this bandeau top like this. It's just this green color. And this did at one point have straps with it but it did not have the straps attached to it, nor did I find any of the other bathing suits that looked like this with the straps on it. So I think it actually goes like this. Yeah. So this top to go with these bottoms and these bottoms have got to be the best high-waisted bottoms I've ever owned because they just fit so perfectly. And like this part isn't so thick where it's like you're covering up all of this. And so it does come up a little more like this instead of, you know, coming down here, it comes up like that. But these two, these two pieces together, and they're also two different color greens, but I thought they looked so cute together. So got these. And also, I think I said all these were a uh, Target brand. This one is Shade and Shore. Have no clue. It could be a Target brand, but I do know this one is a Target brand. So there's this one. And then the last two pieces of the entire haul I want to show you guys. They do not match, but you can always wear a black bottom or top with anything. And I got these bottoms like this. And these also have the little cheeky look to them, but I could not find a matching top to them, but I just thought they were so cute. I couldn't leave them in the store. So got these bottoms. And then actually today I had went to the dirt cheap in a different town to try to find a top that matched those from those swimming bottoms and I found this top and I thought it was so stinking cute again you can wear just about any black top or bottom with anything and it'll look good but this also has some sort of backing to it which I usually don't do the crossing over like that other one or anything with all of these little straps right here it's kind of also hard to show and it's all in motion have no clue where that brand is from ties in the back as well so you can make it looser tighter however you wish but that's going to be all of my summer haul i hope you guys enjoyed let me know down below if you guys have went like summer shopping yet or if you've gotten any clothes and if you have where do you get them from also for the cheap because i'm a cheap girl if you have any recommendations of places to go let a girl know anyhow but i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell notification to be notified when i upload a video and i'll see you next time bye